What's up everybody? This is your boy Timothy Apollo. Like, subscribe, share. So this is your boy in the gym again, getting his cardio on. I'm sorry, I'm gonna try and keep the camera from shaking as much, but check me out. I'm on the treadmill, okay? And I'm about to kick it up a notch, but I just wanted to talk to you ladies out there about the whole Daisy Dukes thing. Yeah, I'm about to have this conversation. See, I'm gonna tell you, two people I Jesus Christ. fought for this. I fought your mamas for this, okay? I fought your mammies for this, and I fought Lizzo, okay? Because since Lizzo just started shaking and twerking and having all the cellulite and stuff hanging out, you know, y'all just done started going wild. And see, bottom line is this, just because they make it for your asses, that don't mean you need to put it on. Sisters, have some dignity, okay? Now, bottom line is this. I don't care what a man tells you when you're out and you're in this. A lot of times, you know, you're gonna have thirsty brothers out there. Seriously, hell, I'm probably one of them, <laughs> you know? I mean, look, ain't nothing wrong with every now and then with putting it out there with, you know, showing off the assets and everything, but let's be real. There's these things called dignity and class, okay? And hell, some places it may not be appropriate, but if you're not gonna have dignity and class with it, then at least work it out before you hang it out. That's right, I said it. See, don't get me wrong, I am all for body positivity, okay? I am, I really am. But, you know, body positivity should be more than just feeling good with your flaws. It should be working on perfecting your flaws, you know? Me, myself, I'm not in terrible shape, but I know that I've got minor flaws that I have to work on. But, you know, a lot of you girls, and it just ain't sisters, but mostly who I see doing it is the sisters, okay? And y'all need to stop. You know, I see shirts all halfway up with your seats, you know, with your scars and all from all your 30-something kids or whatever. You know, I see the Daisy Dukes on and you got to say you like or your knees ain't quite right. Look, stop it, quit it, okay? In the words of Apollo, cease and desist. You know, now don't get me wrong, please don't get it twisted. I think every woman in her own space and her own natural beauty has her own specific beauty, okay? I do, I really do. But that just, that just doesn't mean to just let this stuff hang out. Okay, and some of you, and look at here, I'm gonna be real with you. Some of you be out there with your men. And I don't see how these brothers let that fly because like, yo, don't get me wrong. I know you wanna flex. I know you wanna flunch your sisters out, but you know, if she got that little skull on the stomach, or she got all the cellulite and stuff hanging out, bro, trust me, you ain't flexing. <laughs> you just ain't, you know? And another thing with the bonnets, with the shower caps on, oh my God. Look here, queens, okay? That bonnet is not a crown, it's not. Your pajamas is not royal queen wear, okay? It's just not. So please quit it, you know? If you want people to take you serious, if you want everybody else to respect you, that shit starts with y'all, you know? Seriously, y'all out here showing cesarean sections, um, cellulite hips and all. And just because old thirsty cat like me done ran up on you and said, hey, that look good. You ever heard of this thing called pillow talk? Yeah, it's real, okay? So like I said again, I'm not trying to diss well. I'm not totally trying to diss. I'm just being real. Quit it, have some decency and respect about yourself, okay? Work on your flaws. None of us are perfect. None of us will be perfect, okay? But I'll be goddamn if I'm gonna run out there how all my scars and cellulite and stuff hanging out. It's not cute, okay? And I say this with, with much love and respect because people be laughing. Matter of fact, if you really think about it, when we thirst, when we thirst chases, <laughs> okay? When we be kicking it at you, if you really think about it, we don't really kick it to you in front of everybody now, do we? But anyway, look at this. this is your boy Timothy Apollo. Like, don't like, okay? Share, subscribe, and all that good stuff there. Let me know what y'all thinking about it. 
Am I wrong about feeling like, hey, sisters, women in general need to have more respect and dignity when they walk up out the house instead of coming out with these fucking bonnets on and pajamas and asses all hanging out and stomach and stuff leaking over the, you know, the pants? Or should we just act like you don't see that, you know? And then be mad when somebody else points it out. You guys decide.